I'm Dr. Martin Daishimie, gynecologist obstetrician from Zambia. I'm working in a government hospital. Okay, by now in Zambia we have two private uh, infertility hospital. In the in public we don't have. In the public we do just basic assessment and uh, co just basic consultation, assessment and the treatment. If it comes on reference, just we refer on those centers, but the challenge, those centers they are very much expensive and almost all our patients can't afford. So it remains a challenge on the patients. By now, embryologist, I think I know one, but she's in a, in a private clinic. And those who has done this training from Medicaid, they may um, not remember the, the number, but they are around the two or three. So I'm not sure if those private, they are using a, a specialist and embryologist. Okay. By, by now, we have general gynecology obstetric in a postgraduate, where they may be having like a general information on infertility, but not like we have done it. In the other, other way, you can say there is no specialist training in our infertility in our country. The fertility treatment in our country is still a challenge and a problem on the patient because of awareness. First of all, awareness, infrastructure, knowledge, and, and culture. On awareness, it is still the question of the women. So the, the husband is still considering her, himself every time normal. So it becomes a problem during consultation because many times we find women are fighting alone on fertility while it is a couple issue and a problem. If it comes on in, clinic, in clinics and the hospital, may we, we have a few, patient, few doctors who can even understand what is going on, who can, who can diagnose, who can investigate, and who can even transfer the patient where they have to be transferred. If it comes on infrastructure, yes, as I mentioned that, we don't have any specialist clinic in the public, only one too expensive in private. Yes, as we have two IVF centers in private, they have all options because even they do IVF, they do ICC, but in the, in the public, it is still there's no facility, there's no option that are being, being given there. By the way, as long as we go back, we can start just offering like IUI according to the few infrastructure that we can arrange through our respective working area. Yeah, the challenges from community, the awareness is very, very low. It's very on on very low level. Even it is still considered as infertility is a woman problem. So that the women are suffering on infertility while it is a couple problems. My expectation, yes, I've met it, but in the future we still continue having a challenge during dispensation of what you have rent because of re 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 few infrastructures and we need to encourage on awareness and even us we will need to continue upgrading our level of understanding and knowledge according to the update of every day and we will continue to need many other skills on IVF and the infertility. Thank you. On my coming colleagues, I have to say that this training is very important, very knowledgeable, very rich in knowledge and the experience. I, I, will, urge, I will urge them to be very patient and having good courage to learn because it is a tough and co we in a short time we have to get much information, but information that will be that will be for great importance in a, our future Andover 
with infertility. This training will help me to improve how I was dispensing my, my clinical services. Because I was getting a fertility couple, sometimes I was even missing what to say. But by now, I'm very knowledgeable on diagnosis, treating, and even I can facilitate in the orientation of my patient. So I think I will, it will be easier on me now to be in contact with my patient with infertility problems. I would like to thank Mary Ketch Foundation and Mary Ketch Foundation in the more than a mother and Indira IVF Academy for providing this training. That is a very, a very good uh, in, on my, our knowledge and our practice for the future and for our country, our patient and in the group and all uh, women in all and um, three thing, thank you Marriage Foundation for this great opportunity to to learn what about infertility and IVF in common. Zambia. Mm -hmm.